welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel today in this practical video i will guide you for construction of cantilever beam for this residential building guys you can see this is residential building and here you can see this cantilever beam length is four feet on the top of this we have cantilever slab you can see at the end you can see brick masonry is being done which height is eight feet so let me guide you for steel reinforcement inside this cantilever beam. We have here three steel rods at the bottom portion and four steel rods in upper portion of this cantilever beam. The dia is 16 millimeter for upper portion also for down portion. That's why because cantilever beam steel reinforcement is changed from the simply supported beam. In upper portion here we have four steel rods. In bottom portion we have three steel rods. And the dia is 16 millimeter. That's why because this is not simply supported beam. And size of this beam is 14 by 12 inches. Okay, with slab this is 14 by 20, uh, 12 by 20 inches with slab depth. Okay, but without the slab this is. 14 feet by 12 feet 14 inches by 12 inches the depth is 12 uh, it, uh, the depth is 14 inches and the depth uh, width is 12 inches so guys so this is one of the important video in which i have discussed the cantilever beam steel reinforcement and the stirrup spacing is here four inches or you can say 100 millimeter you can see by clearly this is cantilever beam so if you are working on construction site so you should know about cantilever beam length inside steel reinforcement etc you can see guys here this is plinth beam depth is 12 inches and width is 9 inches inside this we have four steel rods at the bottom and two at the top as you can see here uh, the black stones you can see uh, this is the plinth level on the top of this this is plinth beam and as i discussed the size of plinth beam on the top of this plinth beam you can see this is brick masonry so that one you can see this is top beam so we have here two beams okay plinth beam and top beam but uh, we don't have here and the uh, uh, you can say the tie beam or you can say the lentil beam we don't have here so let me show you the lentil beam how they did here as you can see the place of lentil beam they uh, constructed on the top of the doors and windows guys you can see with the thickness of three inches they did uh, three numbers of steel rods dia is 12 millimeter three numbers of bars here only on the top of the uh, door and window sections let me show you guys you can see this is a short video but very important to know about cantilever beam plant beam and lentil beam thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye